the speedy asteroid will come flying past Earth perilously close in the early evening hours today, September 10. NASA estimates the rock will come closest to Earth around 8.13 p.m. BST, 7.13 p.m. UTK. The asteroid's flyby is being tracked by NASA's Center for Near-Earth Object Studies, GNEOS, at the California Institute of Technology. NASA's GNEOS tracks all asteroids and comets that threaten to strike Earth. Tonight's asteroid, dubbed by NASA Asteroid 2019 RG2, is an Apollo-type near-Earth object or NEO. Apollo asteroids fly around the inner rings of the solar system on a trajectory similar to asteroid 1862 Apollo. NEOs, on the other hand, are all comets and asteroids that closely orbit the Earth. Occasionally, a NEO like RG2 will catastrophically cross paths with our home planet. NASA said, as they orbit the Sun, near-Earth objects can occasionally approach close to Earth. Near-Earth objects can occasionally approach close to Earth. NASA Note that a close passage astronomically can be very far away in human terms, millions or even tens of millions of kilometers. The U.S. Space Agency estimates asteroid RG2 measures somewhere in the range of 29 feet to 65.6 feet, 8.9 meters to 20 meters. When a 65.6 feet, 20 meters, rock exploded over Russia's Chelyabinsk Oblast in 2013, the shock wave blew out windows in a wide radius and injured more than 1,000 people with shards of glass. At the time, NASA dubbed the unexpected asteroid strike a wake-up call to the threats lurking in space. Asteroid RG2 will make a so-called Earth close approach tonight but, thankfully, it will not hit the planet. The space rock will close in on Earth at breakneck speeds of around 21.99 km per second or 49,190 miles per hour, 79,166 km per hour. At its closest approach, the asteroid will near miss the Earth from a distance of approximately 0.00350 astronomical units, O. Oh. A single astronomical unit measures the distance from the Earth to the Sun or about 93 million miles, 149.6 million kilometer. This means asteroid RG2 will safely pass us from a distance of 325,345 miles. 523,529 kilometers. The distance is equal to just 1.36 times the distance from Earth to the Moon, an incredibly close brush with the rock. After tonight's flyby, NASA does not expect the space rock to make another appearance in Earth's neighborhood in the foreseeable future.